Time now for the morning stir and a breakthrough. New treatment for thinning hair. The answer may already be in your body. ABC's Lindsay Janice has the details. Why is my hair falling out? The answer to thinning hair may no longer mean this. I'm not only the hair club president, but I'm also a client. Now, a promising new hair loss treatment for women and men may help to regrow and thicken hair without surgery, drugs, or expensive ointments. Just look at these before and afters. And the secret may be something you already have. This is the best kept secret in the world. It's called platelet-rich plasma therapy, or PRP. And research is preliminary, but promising. Doctors who use it say it works by injecting the platelets from the patient's own blood directly into the scalp, saying that they contain growth factors that stimulate the regrowth and thickening of hair follicles. Tanisha Jimenez believes that years of pulling her hair back caused her to lose some around her face. I had to make sure that my hair was in front never pushed back because I felt so insecure walking around. She says that just weeks after her first treatment, the hair started to regrow. This after just one treatment. It's amazing. You can actually see where the hairs have grown. Is this a cure for baldness? This is not a cure for baldness. It's a treatment for baldness. What we're doing is increasing the diameter of the size of the hair follicle, and we're keeping the hairs that would stop growing in the growing phase. It's simple. Blood is drawn, the plasma separated in a machine. This is the platelet-rich plasma. Giving hope to millions with thinning hair. For Good Morning America, Lindsay Janice, ABC News, New York. And ABC News senior medical contributor Dr. Jennifer Ashton is back. What is your take on this and is there any downside? Incredibly promising. I've seen the results. They are actually impressive. There are always downsides. There's a little discomfort with the small needle pricks. There's probably a low risk of infection just from injecting the scalp like there always is. But there's the cost. It's about $400 or so per treatment. It sounds like a lot, which it is. But when you balance that against what people who have thinning hair mm -hmm. spend to treat that problem, it's probably a Wash. You said per treatment about how many treatments do you need? You can see results after just one treatment, really? but typically mm -hmm. it's one treatment, then another one a month later, and then probably a third. Sure, it varies from person to exactly. person. Exactly. I have to tell you, it's very emotional for men and women when they start to yep. lose their hair for various reasons, and there are various causes for, for why you lose your hair. A absolutely, and this is a key topic for so many people. It really hits hard. There are hormonal reasons. You can have a high testosterone. There can be side effects of many medications that we tend to not even think about it until we see that hair mm. thinning and then just age but this is so promising it works in all ethnic types so this is potentially a big advance and so if you are losing your hair for whatever reason what are some of the things that you can do I usually tell people start with a visit to a dermatologist if that's possible they may do a scalp biopsy which can help elucidate what is actually causing this multivitamins B complex biotin mm. can always help rest your hair I do it every weekend it's not pretty but that means don't style it don't wash it Mm -hmm. give it a break from those products and then lastly the over-the-counter products like minoxidil they do work but I caution people male or female if you use them put a towel over your pillow because you'll grow hair on your face as really? well as your head yeah oh uh, I know. who knew <laughs> there you go